hey cuties peachy here welcome back to a new video in this video i'll be unboxing and reviewing margot de perla she's one of the dolls i've been most excited for just because she's so divine looking but first let's take a look at her box so all the boxes look the same they have a palm tree on the side they say pacific coast on the box with the accessories um obviously the name margot de perla is up here and the artwork, here we have Margot, Hallie, and Phaedra on the box. So yeah, and obviously you can see her here. I tried to pick one that looked good. And then on one side, she has the other palm tree and more birds. And on the back, we see the whole gang. And it says here, meet the students of Pacific Coast, the most elite fine arts high school on the West Coast. On the other side, we have her focus, which is accessory design focus so cute okay so let's get her unboxed okay and i'm back and here she is fully unboxed miss margo so let's take a closer look at her face up so her face is super pretty look just so blurry <laughs> she has freckles on her a little bit of blush she has very light pink lips she has some really nice eyeshadow going on with different layers and her eyes are super light blue like i love how they look yeah her eyebrows are very pale uh very light brown she is wearing a headscarf i love how iridescent it is it's very much like every color is here very pearly it printed on are these two gold straps with buckles um, and on the back, look at how pretty that is. Look at how beautifully they flare out. Now, obviously, they don't come like that. They come like this. But, like, just look at how pretty they are once you play with them a little bit. Like, just, like, two leaves, you know? I love it. Um, yeah, it's Velcro. You can open it up um, if you want to and take it off. I love it. I'm going to keep it on her. Um, her hair is, like, so pastel. It's reminding me of Kaya Heart. Um, it has a lot of shades of periwinkle, light purple, turquoise, light blue, even some hidden, um, can you see it? It's like very, it's like very few in between, but like you see here, like almost white, white streaks, pearly white, pearly pinks. Um, and of course she has tinsel in her hair as well. It is a little bunched up here with tinsel, but I don't mind, honestly. The tinsel, I kind of like, it makes her look special. Um, and her hair has no product. I only have to comb out the ends a little bit, but it's so soft, it is so wavy. It's so nice and full and just look how pretty it is. New colors everywhere. Super long as well. She does have some shedding. So just be wary. Of course, she has a bikini on, a bikini two-piece. The top has some straps on, some lace straps. Then we have a RR buckle here in gold in the center. I love how it's kind of like a cut here, like a mermaid top. And then she has a little added piece of fabric here at the bottom. And they all have the same pattern that's iridescent in kind of all the colors with a rainbow uh, printed on. Her manicure. She has you know, just pearly kind of manicure, nothing special. She has this really cute cover up here that's a separate piece. The fabric's really thin, <laughs> but it is lined with these really nice pearls at the bottom. It's like a really delicate trim. I'm honestly scared it's gonna rip off or something. <laughs> Cause as you can see, it has some, look at the fabric here. It almost looks like it's really um, stretched out or something. So I would be careful if I were you. I love how all of it is lined with pearls, even back, like I'm telling you. And then here it comes to like a little bow, as you can see, it's supposed to be a bow. Um, really cute, love that. It just kind of goes up like this though. Um, it's shaped very nicely. And then once you take this off, we can see her bottom piece, which is again, same fabric, like her top piece. And she has um another buckle in gold but this one says rh and it's a different one from this one this is not velcroed so it might be harder to take off but this top is velcroed on and she has white underwear painted on her shoes are the highlight for me i mean look at these shoes the heels are literal orbs <laughs> they look like pearls obviously that is crazy that looks like something lady gaga would wear you know like <laughs> 
<laughs> I love that. I, I'm almost like curious if these shoes really exist in real life with like a orb heel. Um, that is beautiful. They're all shimmery, translucent, and the straps say rainbow on them. And the bottoms are colored. They're painted in a silvery, really nice glittery sheen. Her doll stand is really pretty. It's in a really pretty pearly color. As you can see, it has a really nice sheen to it. It's almost like yellow gold. Um, it really does look like a pearl, kind of like a pearly shine to it. I love it. And her brush, obviously, has the same look. Her sunglasses are so pretty. Oh my gosh, like just look at how stylish they look. They have a gradient from pink to light to blue at the bottom here, as you can see. Yeah, you can tell right there on the white background, yeah. <laughs> she has the R on each side, a little orb here. The little, um, how do you call them? Things are in a white, I think. Yeah, like a white paint. The shape just looks so nice. Look at that. Here is her purse. Oh my gosh, this purse is my favorite. Look at how cute it is. This is the only purse that isn't in like a tote bag design or form. She has like a strap here. It has gold fabric. It's woven with a ribbon in the middle. She has a handle here. It's all fabric, not like the other ones where the handle is plastic. This is a functioning purse. Look at this. It has to um, the, the, the strap here that goes all the way around. And then you take this little piece and you pull it. It's like, it actually works. That is adorable. Obviously it says rainbow on it, Paris, and RR here in the middle. I thought these were pearls, but they almost feel like um, gummy. So I don't think these are pearls. These are, this is like um, printed on or something. I'm not sure. This is such a nicely made purse. I love this for her. Lastly, we have her cute little beach towel. It is the same print like her scarf. We can see here the iridescent sheen and pastel colors, and of course, the gold buckle here surrounding it. So yeah. And I'm back after styling her a little bit, combing her hair a little more. Um, I still love her hair. And I put this undershirt that came with Crystal Bailey. I put it under her bikini top, and I feel like that's a really cute layering choice. I don't know, I feel like it matches her hair. It matches her iridescent sheen of her um, headscarf really well. And I did also add her um, a, a little pair of socks that came with violet um, that also have this iridescent shine. I also put an elastic band around her waist to keep her um, added on wrap a little higher and a little tighter so but i feel i feel like that's a cute little girly look um i'm not sure if i should keep the socks on or off i feel like the socks do match but yeah i'm not sure <laughs> i feel like that looks cute i don't know tell me what do you think of this look for her which pieces would you suggest i used otherwise on her if you already have a margo keep in mind i don't have the winter break dolls so I can't use Skylar's fur jacket on her, which I would have loved to do because it would have looked stunning, but I can't do that because I don't have her because I don't want to get duplicates of characters. So I only have the core characters, uh, new, new characters. But yeah, you guys, that was the video. I hope you all enjoyed. Be sure to give me a big thumbs up if you did. Be sure to leave any thoughts or questions you have down below. Let me know what you thought of Margaret Perla. Who is your favorite from this line? Who are you most excited to get? Let me know what you thought down below. And as always, don't forget to subscribe. Hit the notification bell if you haven't already so you don't miss out when I post a more Rainbow High Doll news, doll reviews, and episode reaction videos. Stay safe. Be kind. I hope this next time. Stay peachy. Kisses.